Botnets are a combination of the words robot and network. Each infected device is called a bot. Botnets can be designed to perform illegal or malicious tasks, such as sending spam, stealing data, ransomware, clicking on ads fraudulently, distributed denial of service attacks. What are botnets? Built on the client server model, botnets are networks of computers infected by malware that are under the control of a single threat actor known as the bot herder. The bot herder relies on a command and control server, C2, to administrate the bots, and since the infected computers are under the control of the C2, a botnet infection is like having a malicious hacker inside your network. When used by cybercriminals, botnets are especially useful for carrying out large-scale attacks systematically. How do botnets work? A distributed denial-of-service attack is a traditional botnet attack example. Botnets were originally used to carry out DDoS attacks or propagate spam. As they matured, some botnet infections evolved to include keyloggers to record your keystrokes, allowing bad actors to capture the usernames and passwords that you use to log into your favorite services like email, streaming services, financial institutions, and social media. The botnets of today are much more sophisticated. A botnet attack is typically delivered in the form of a Trojan, as an email attachment or maliciously embedded in software that you might download. And while antivirus software might provide some protection, oftentimes the botnet delivery methods are sophisticated enough to evade detection even by the best antivirus software. Once botnet malware is installed, it steals information from your computer, including usernames and passwords, passkeys, hostnames from browsers and FTP clients, browser cookies and tokens, autofill data, crypto wallet addresses, files with specific extensions, screenshots of the desktop, chat history, list of installed programs and running processes, machine globally unique identifier, GUID, as well as system architecture, system language, username and computer name. Here are some key aspects of mobile botnets. Compromised devices. Mobile botnets typically consist of smartphones and other mobile devices that have been infected with malware. This malware can be distributed through malicious apps, phishing attacks, or exploiting vulnerabilities in the device's operating system. Command and control infrastructure. The botnet relies on a central server or a network of servers known as the command and control infrastructure. This infrastructure is used by the attackers to send commands to the compromised devices and receive information from them. Propagation methods. Mobile botnets can spread through various means, such as malicious apps, SMS phishing, smishing, email attachments, and social engineering tactics. Once a device is infected, it becomes part of the botnet. Malicious activities. Once a mobile device is part of a botnet, it can be used for a range of malicious activities. This may include sending spam messages, participating in DDoS attacks, stealing sensitive information, like login credentials and financial data, or even conducting click fraud to generate revenue. Detection and Mitigation Detecting and mitigating mobile botnets can be challenging due to the distributed nature of the attacks. Security measures often include antivirus software, network monitoring, and behavioral analysis to identify suspicious activities. Mobile operating system updates also play a crucial role in fixing vulnerabilities that could be exploited by malware. Protective Measures Users can protect themselves from mobile botnets by being cautious about the apps they install, avoiding clicking on suspicious links, keeping their devices updated with the latest security patches, and using reputable antivirus or security apps. Regulatory Efforts 
governments and regulatory bodies may enact measures to combat mobile botnets, such as imposing stricter app store policies, encouraging cybersecurity awareness, and prosecuting individuals involved in botnet activities. Mobile botnets pose a serious threat to the security and privacy of mobile device users. As technology evolves, so do the tactics employed by cybercriminals, making it essential for individuals and organizations to stay vigilant and adopt robust security practices.